Hello and welcome to Hyping Tech. So in this episode, we're going to be looking at our Dell Precision Workstation PC that we picked up and we're going to see how it currently is and see what upgrades we can do on it. So let me see if I can slowly lower that down and open it up and show you what's inside. So we have also, we got it delivered. It came very nicely packaged and I've already gone around and given it a wipe with antibacterial wipes and current situations, you want to make sure everything's extra clean so that is looking at it let me show you just the actual down cam so i think i can do that by doing one of these clickings here there we go so right now you can see inside here we have a pci slot available to put a graphics card in we're going to be smashing a graphics card in there we're going to check the thermal paste on the cpu because it is an older system we've got two four gigabyte ram sticks already present and what's this here we've got a bit of Oh, look at that. We've got a bit of a uh, bonus fluff free. So we do need to give it a bit of a clean. We'll hoover that out. And we're going to put two extra slot uh, 4 gig RAM in there. So it's a total of 16 gig of RAM. We've got a 500 uh, megabyte mechanical hard drive. We're going to put SSD in there. We're going to put the graphics card in there. Give it some more RAM. And we should be good. And in total, that should not cost us any more than 130 for the whole system. We paid about... £10 for the two extra RAMs, so that comes up to £140. We've got a graphics card which you can pick up for about £30. So, what's that? I lost count. £130, £40, £50, £60, £170. £170 for a full on gaming PC. We'll show you how it performs and if it can handle playing games as well as streaming the game at 1080p on the internet using a software like OBS, so it's intensive on the computer, having Discord open, having some Internet Explorer open, and maybe even some extra windows to see how it copes with it. So all that's going to be coming in this series of videos. So make sure to check out that and see how this desktop performs. We had an old desktop, which is a, a dual core, which did not cope very well. We also had a laptop, which is a Sony laptop that we kind of got ready for that. But that I think we were asking too much of it. So now we actually need a desktop machine to give us enough power and not overheat because obviously there'll be better cooling this. So let's see you on the next video as part of the series and you will enjoy it. Let's see how we come on with this upgrade of an old business work system machine. Wham, bam, strawberry jam.